Good morning, Lego fans. I am Brickwise, and today I am joined by... Lego fan. today we're doing a review of the entryway of the Luigi's Mansion. We sure are. This is set number 71399 with 504 pieces. It's a 7 plus set. And also, now we have all the Luigi's Mansion stuff. If you haven't watched the other our videos, you might want to check those other ones out to make this understand. We forgot to do that. Oh, good job. So we're going to show you all the different things that it does first, and then we'll give you a bit of a review. So yeah. first off, this is the entryway. So if you picture this as the opening to the mansion itself, uh, which another set is the inside, but you can, you have a start tag right here. So you go there and you get 90 seconds to complete it. You do need one of the sets with either Peach, Luigi, or Mario in order to end it. <clears throat> but and, once you start it, you go through the gate. And also, there's on the first one, there is also a pack to bust the ghost. We don't have that on the Ouija right now, but we might find it and show you. Yeah. So, a couple of things here. So, you can use Luigi to hit the Buzzy Beetle into the purple ghost. We're going to move Peach out of the way here for a moment. No, he means all of them. It can be all of them. <laughs> that was long. Yeah, so didn't quite get it. Oh, there we go. Now, we now because we don't have the uh, ghost busting pack on him, if we hit the ghost, he's going to get scared and not be able to beat him unless he has a superstar. Then there's the dog guy right here. You can scan him and he shows up and gives you some coins. Well, also, there's also a golden bone on it and we, and if you scan him with that, he I give you more coins, but we'll talk about that more later. Yep. So the next thing would be you hit the thing right here which brings the pail for the well up and then you can stand on <clears throat> it's okay so then we can you got six coins so you can stand on oh. okay you stand on the doorway entrance and then move it and it opens the door so we're going to go ahead and turn everything around now so let's go all right, so from this side, once you have everything through here, then Luigi comes through, and then he can stand on this one and rotate to close the door. And then you can find the golden bowl, which I was talking a little earlier about it. And now yet scan the ghost dog. Well, so now the door is closed, so now you have to go back on the, the gear, open the door back up. And go back, go back through. So we'll turn this back around again. Why is he going? <laughs> and slide back up. And then, if you scan that, then the ghost dog is happy. It gives you more coins than if you just simply scan him. Because I think it gives you two if you scan him without a golden bone. I think it's three. I don't know how many with the golden bone, but I, I think, think it's five. I think it's five with the golden bone. Yeah. <gasps> Jinx. <laughs> what is there for five? Oh, okay. Uh, so with that being said, though, what else? Because, I mean, that's that's a lot we just talked about. That's all the different things. Um, I'm going to say, oh, sorry for that. Uh, I'm going to say I do like the door mechanic, how it opens and closes yeah. by moving the slide. Um, what else, though? What, what, uh... I would... Oh, you know what we didn't show? What? I keep on forgetting about this little guy right here. He yeah. comes with a boo as well. So if you didn't get boo during the mystery pack, um, that I think he was in series one or two. Uh, there was a couple other sets no, that had I boo in them. I feel like you're talking about this bill 
that one was in season one, but I think there there was the Bashful Boo in like season two or three, the series pack two or three. Um, this one right here was yeah. one of the series pack ones too. Uh, so if you didn't get this guy, then there's this one. There was another set that had a regular Boo in it as well as the one that um, the one that was shown here. But overall, I mean. I think this is pretty neat. He's got a lot of usefulness. The entryway, the doorway is, is well set up, in my opinion. The Buzzy Beetle shell uh, is kind of neat to have. It'd be nice if there was a Buzzy Beetle scanner, I guess. But <clears throat> I guess there's not a Buzzy Beetle in it. So if you don't know what the ghost we got, then this ghost we got, and he's missing the crown, and the, so the garbage can goes and this go for us from season two oh, and these, then no these this, these three weren't from season two these three were from the inside of the mansion yeah and then these two characters were from season one not inside season two. of the this was mansion. the this is uh uh professor e gad's workshop where you get the the suit for luigi also has the golden ghost. Yeah. So that's all the ghosts, all of the characters. There's also a toad in one yeah. of them too, but uh, and he's missing his crown right now. Um, but overall, I mean, any anything else you'd say about the Luigi's Mansion entryway? I would say that it's pretty cool, mm -hmm. but I wish they added like something like the toad and the mirror. I wish they added like that one little speck. Yeah, this guy in the yeah, I kids on front and mansion. I would think it would be cool if they yeah, like, added another boo in the other window and also the boo like a secret entryway to like like Maybe a signing ghost, a fancy ghost, like the golden ghost. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, I could see that for sure. Maybe more, so it sounds like more characters and maybe an additional um, hidden feature. Yeah. Okay. But I was always thinking on these sets, they are all cool, but... They all need like their own little oh guy. Two of them have that one little guy, Egad and Toad, but I think they should on this one they should like have a like nice ghost well they do they've got the ghost dog this no, is the character for this one i was talking about like a owner for the ghost dog and he would like be nice okay well i think this is um about i think this is about good i i mean would you recommend this set for someone who likes the lego marios yeah okay i i would too I think of the Lego Mario sets, this is my favorite one, actually. I would say... The Lego Super Mario Luigi's Mansion one. Not all of the Mario sets, but the I Luigi's Mansion one. I would say the second one inside that we got was the best. Okay. With Toad. Good. And this guy, and this guy, and this guy. Yep, I could see that, I could see that. Well, with that being said, uh, Peach has gone to sleep. I'm sure Mario and Luigi are, are not far behind. So I think we're going to go ahead and end the video. Don't forget to subscribe to BrickWise for more Lego videos. Like the video and uh, make sure to throw a comment down below. If you have this set, if uh, which one is your favorite Luigi's Mansion set? With you and have like that? and subscribe. Correct, correct. With that being said, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Goodbye. Goodbye.